Hi there, my name's Chris Watson and I'm the director here at Ray White Ringwood. I just wanted to take this opportunity to reach out to our clients, our buyers, sellers, tenants, landlords, and I suppose give you a little bit of the State of the Union and, and, and let everyone know what is happening in the real estate world. There's also been some changes and we are still trading, we are still listing and selling real estate, but it's far from business as usual. Um, a couple of the changes that have been brought into effect are, well, simply, we can't do open homes anymore. So, we can still show property, but we're not able to do open homes. So, at, at, at Ray White, we understand that an open home is a really, really important and integral part of a buyer's search for property, but we can't do those anymore. So, what we are doing is the next best thing. We're doing virtual tours. So, what, what is actually happening on all of our properties that we have for sale at the moment is that the agents have gone through the property, recorded a video as if they were doing a tour of the property. Uh, it goes for about seven or eight minutes. I did three yesterday on a couple of properties that went live with the market this week. And a buyer is able to watch that video and then they can decide whether they would actually like to physically inspect the property. And of course, if you would like to physically inspect the property, we are still able to do private inspections. And so if you inquire on the property, speak to the agent that's selling, we'll of course arrange a time for you on a one-on-one -on -one basis. Uh, another change is auctions. We are still able to do auctions, but we're not able to do public auctions. So we have a term uh, that we've used, which is called a private auction. So what that means is we still conduct the auction. Our technology allows us to stream that auction. And so any bidder uh, that wants to partake in the auction, they can, but they're not present at the auction. They're actually watching the auction online. If anyone has an interest in that property, be that the vendor's friend, the buyer's friend, the neighbor, perhaps someone that just likes to know what's going on in the market, they're able to watch the auction, but they do it online. They're not able to be physically present. Uh, we actually had three auctions on Wednesday night in this forum. I must admit it was a little bit strange as the auctioneer calling the, uh, calling the auction with no crowd. Um, but they worked, you know, two of the three sold on uh, on Wednesday night. So they sold, they sold well, it just changed a little bit how we did it. Uh, so if you are interested in any auctions that we have coming up, speak to the agent that's selling that property, we can provide you with that link and you're able to watch as you would normally do, but the good thing is you don't have to go and um, stand on the corner of the street, you can do it from the, uh, the comfort of your own home. Another change is, well our office is effectively closed to the public. So we are still operating, we can still have appointments, but they have to be by appointment only. So you can't walk in off the street anymore into our office if you need to pick up keys or you're a trade person or, or any of those sort of things, you will have to make an appointment. Um, all of our phones have been diverted to staff. If you call our office number, you'll get a member of our staff who is actually working from home. All of our staff are working from home, as am I, as you can see, uh, with this video, I'm standing in the back garden at my house. Um, so all of our systems and that allow our staff to be able to do that. There's a couple of things that we're able to do now. We're able to do virtual appraisals. So if you wanted to get your property appraised, it's still an integral part of, uh, of, our, uh, of our country. If you wanted to know the value of your property, we're able to do that. You can reach out to our agents. They might ask you to do a video tour of the home. Uh, whilst they're watching perhaps FaceTime, Google Hangouts, Skype, there's, you know, there's a variety of different websites and uh, apps that allow us to do that. And then they're able to give you an, an appraisal. Uh, we are still able to do uh, talk to vendors about the marketing of their home and the sale of their home. At the moment, we can do that in a one-on-one -on -one basis. We can actually come over to your house and then have that discussion with you. But of course, we can do Skype and Hangouts and everything like that. All of our documentation is able to be signed electronically. So we use a program called DocuHub. We can actually do contracts, authorities, anything that we need to all be done online. All of their marketing proofs, all of the software that we use to build your signboard, your newspaper ad, get your property launched on the realestate.com, all that sort of stuff, that's all done in the cloud. So we're still able to operate remotely. So our administration team, they're working from home, but you know, this business is uh, as somewhat normal, I guess you could say. Since Sunday night, there's been some big changes and we're all probably a little bit uh, curious, is probably the word, how will that affect the market? But this week, well, it's very clear the show goes on. 
Uh, we've had five auctions this week. We brought all of those auctions forward. So some of those properties were due to go to auction on Saturday, some next week. Um, we brought those forward. Some of those were before the Wednesday lockout. So we actually had um, an auction where we actually invited the only the interested parties. Uh, one of those properties that we had was uh, 2 slash 3 Tweed Street in Ringwood East, uh, sold by one of our agents, Cameron Bailey. Uh, it was five bidders at that auction. Uh, the reserve was 660 and it sold for 815. So that's that's $155,000 above the reserve. That's not a sign of a market that's in free fall. Um, we had a total of five auctions this week, of which we sold four out of five. So again, that's not a sign of a fall in market. Um, that's a clearance rate of 80%, you know, really healthy. Um, our mortgage broker just today had four, instead, uh, four appointments with new buyers requiring finance. So the show goes on, people still need to buy, people still need to sell. Yes, we're doing it a little bit differently, but the show goes on. Uh, if you have any questions, you want to know how this impacts uh, your, your property value or has anything that you're looking to do, please reach out. Um, stay safe you know, from all of us at Raywide and Ringwood. Let's hope this all uh, ends quickly and uh, minimal fuss. Thank you very much and hope to see you soon in three dimensions.